and this is the story of the grasshopper and the ant. So once upon a time, on a beautiful summer day, a grasshopper was hopping around lazily in the grass. He felt good about himself. He was happy, well fed, and he was chirping and singing because life was good. While the grasshopper was enjoying the day, an ant was carrying grains and taking them to the nest with great toil. On seeing the hard-working ant passing by, the grasshopper invited him to join him and share his fun. But the ant politely declined and went on with his work. All day long, during the whole summer, the ant would work hard collecting food while the grasshopper enjoyed the bright summer days. The grasshopper would look at the ant and laugh. Why do you work so hard, dear ant? He would say. Come, rest for a while. Listen to my song. Summer is here, the days are long and bright. Why waste the sunshine in labor and toil? I am helping to lay up food for the winter, said the ant, and recommend you do the same. Why bother about winter, said the grasshopper. We have got plenty of food at present, and there is still plenty of time to prepare for winter. But the ant knew what he was doing, and went on his way and continued his toil. All day long the ant would work, without stop or rest, scurrying back and forth from the field, collecting the grains and storing them carefully in her larder. Instead of working and preparing for winter, the grasshopper preferred to dance, sing and play at his leisure. He did not realize that the wonderful summer days will not last forever and soon cold and rainy days would be near. And so summer faded into autumn and autumn turned into winter. The sun was hardly seen, the days got shorter and nights got longer. It became freezing cold and snow began to fall. When the cold winter came, the grasshopper realized that the ant had been right and he should have been prepared. Now the grasshopper didn't feel like singing anymore. He should not have wasted all his time when food was plentiful. He was cold and hungry. He hadn't thought that this winter might be worse than usual. And because he hadn't stored food for himself or helped anyone else to do it, he would not live to see another summer. He had nowhere to shelter from the snow, no one would help him, and so he found himself dying of hunger. While he saw the ant enjoying the food stored and collected in the summer. You see in life, in your life, work hard today and you can reap the benefits tomorrow. Enjoy life, but also dedicate a third of your day to learning, working, or preparing for the winter. Make a plan, visualize what you want to achieve, and start working towards it. If you don't know how to start, just start. You'll figure it out in no time. The beginning is always the hardest. Also, as soon as you become a bit successful with what you do, don't stop the hard work and keep on going. That way, your success will grow exponentially. Thanks for watching and stay blessed.